MacArthur, Bernie Falls State Park is one of the best places I always like to visit. Been coming here for so many years. Went to the gift store to get myself a new patch because I've used up the other one. <laughs> I was going to meet Peter Alexander and his family here. They're having a big uh, family re reunion every 4th of July. It's a good thing too because the park was packed. Mm, I set up my campground at their campsite. Just behind their tents. You can see how full up the place was. They went in pretty good style. Nice little canopy at night, solar powered Christmas lights. The way you're supposed to camp, the best way. And lots of good food, lots of good company. Yeah, the place was packed in 90 degrees. Pretty intense heat wave. I remember the days when it was like in the 80s. But. You still had the shade of these wonderful trees, these ponderosa pines. And of course you had the Bernie Falls itself because once you go down that little ravine down to the bottom, it gets really cool really fast. Or you can go to the top. In this case, walking over Bernie Creek just before it goes over the falls. Eh. It's an interesting place, especially when you realize you're on the Pacific Crest Trail. It goes right through here. And all the foliage is just so wonderfully beautiful and it's so peaceful, quiet, lots of shade. Lots of lava rocks, too. Uh, this is interesting. This loop trail goes past a PG&E uh, cabin site area for their employees. Every year they reserve the place for their employees to come and visit. It was a really beautiful place. It's been there since the 1900s. This is the trail that goes to it. Right past MacArthur Lake. And this trail takes you back toward the falls and at the bottom of the pool. Notice all the lava rock formations. This is all this area. This is ancient flows and it's all basalt. And there's the falls themselves. The water is actually coming through the rock. It's really quite magnificent. Can't get enough of it. <laughs> 